Good morning and welcome to the Mike Show for Saturday, August 13th, 2022. 53 degrees at 7.04 a.m. and I'm your host, Pat Kamal. And I'm still a sinner. And I'm still a tired sinner. And I'm sure I still got some aches and pains somewhere, but... I'm here with my brother, Prince and co-star, Samuel. My brother, Prince and co-star, Michael. And my brother, Prince and co-star, Sullivan. And my sister, Princess and co-star, Elsie, are off on morning adventures out that way somewhere. And I haven't seen my brother, Prince and co-star, Max. And it's disconcerting. We've been out here for a while. And he hasn't come out of the house which I let open the door earlier and let everybody out, and I didn't see him then. So I don't know if he's out on an adventure or in the house somewhere. But anyway, it's a quiet morning in this bucolic dwarf. We slept at camp again last night. Oh, boy. And I'm enjoying a cup of coffee. And a fairly quiet morning. There's a crow calling in the distance. The sound of machinery and traffic. And I just got a feeling we might be getting some rain this morning. I don't know for sure. Oh boy, what do you think, Sam? We gotta give you your pill yet, hey? We gotta give you your pill. Tammy was with me, curled up with me all night for which I am grateful, as I am grateful for another day of life, for the warm, dry, safe place we had to sleep, the breath and gift of this day. Oh boy, let's do a recap from yesterday. It's tough to remember things. The brain's going softer all the time. But what did we do? We were going to take our fat bike after after coffee and wake up time. We were going to drive out to Rockport and ride the fat bike. And lo and behold, we discovered our seat post was frozen. And we did manage to get it out. But it was quite a battle and I almost wrenched my back out of shape. So, we went went and ordered a new one from the bike shop and then pedaled the Kona out to Rockport and swam a bit once we got there and pedaled home. But I guess before I did all that stuff, I did go to save a lot and pick up a few groceries. We had the day off from work and when I got back from save a lot, I went on a total pig out. I had a nice salad did some of my cross-cultural cooking. I grilled some hot dogs, put them in a fajita with some, some of the uh, seasoned beef I make and rolled them up and ate those. And I was on a peanut butter pretzels kick. Oh boy, we read to the loves from a book called The Golden Orange, which I thought I read once I started reading it, I thought I read it years ago when I was a drunk, an active drunk, I should say. And I was waiting for a part about the woman making the protagonist a killer omelet. And we hit that yesterday, I think in chapter 9 or chapter 10, she said she was going to make a killer omelet for the guy. And... So I did read this book years ago, but like I said, I was drunk, actively drunk, and it's all new to me for the most part, except for that part. But there's something in the recesses and cracks and storage areas of my brain that tells me that she had something to do with him, because he's having spotty memories of this woman 
every time he hears the song Where or When, sung by Frank Sinatra in the dive bar. It's on the jukebox. So anyway, city chickens flying in. We had sky rats flying over. It's cool this morning again, and this weather is really reminding me more of like September weather than August weather. And no idea what we're going to do today. Hey, Sam, I work from 5 till 9, and we got a whole day to fill. We'll probably do some biking, hang with these loves, who knows. But right now we're going to sit here and enjoy some coffee. Some time with these loves, the morning quiet, and we're going to take a break. Welcome back, and I don't mean that at all. There's that Sullivan. There's that Bobby Sullivan. You having a good adventure? Hearing a cardinal singing in the distance. Sully's having a little breakfast. Sammy went back inside. Still no sign of Max, which is very disconcerting. Very disconcerting. Oh boy, we're just gonna sit here and I don't know, what do you do? We're back again and there's that princess. There's that princess. What you doing, baby? Sammy's sitting over in his chair. There's that Sullivan coming back. Mikey's coming back from an adventure. He just peed on one of the arbs over there. And Mackie is right through that concrete. For some reason, he doesn't want to come out today. And it's disconcerting that he's up there and not coming down. I don't know if he's in pain from his surgical procedure, if he's got some kind of infection going on or what it is. Else just went back in. Sully just went back in. We got about a cup and a half of coffee to go. A few more readings. Yeah, time for another break. Well, we finished our morning uh, meditation books and our prayers and our coffee and thinking of making some more coffee. There's that Mikey. He's sitting here with me. And there's that Sullivan. There's that Sullivan. I think Princess Elsie went back in the house. Sammy's sitting in the recliner. Mackie still hasn't come outside. And it is very disconcerting for me. It looks like I just caught a glimpse of some city chickens landing to feed. There's a couple more flying in. Oh boy, there goes neighbor slash cousin John. Church bells ringing. What time is it? Who knows? Who cares? It's always today and it's always now. Well, after a flurry of activity, we are back. Where's that Sullivan? We're in the process of baking bread. We made a nice coffee. Got a cardinal singing in the distance. He's trying to get some. He's trying to get some. That Sammy's over here. Tammy, you all right, Bobby? We got to give you your pill. Oh, yeah, still no sign of Max coming from his hiding spot downstairs. City chickens have all took off. We got a treat yesterday. We haven't, uh, here comes that Sullivan. Here comes that Sullivan. We haven't uh, had any corn on the cob lately, and we purchased some, uh, or this year, I should say. We haven't had any corn on the cob this year. We purchased some yesterday. And I got three ears of corn and we're going to eat it today. Nothing better than fresh local sweet corn. Couldn't find any by one of our famous local growers. But I did buy some at the grocery store yesterday at Save-A-Lot. and So we're going to have that. Oh, discovered something disconcerting on Sully. Come here, Sully. Oh, there's the church bell again. It's 8.30. Yeah. Come here. Come here, Bobby. Come here, Bobby. Seven. Where the fuck did that bruise come from? Holy shit. 
All right, come here, Sully. I'm going to try and show that red spot there where I don't know if he's been scratching or him and Mikey went at it. Come on, Sully. Anyway, not a good thing. Not a good thing. Well, we can't get it in there. That's all we got this morning. From the cold gray ashes and coals of my cold black heart and my broken, beaten, battered, bruised, and burdened and bloody, cracked, shattered, empty, hopeless, and forlorn soul. Piss off. Happy Saturday, and thanks for not tuning in. Sully, let me show him that spot on your ear. There it is. See? See how it's red there? What the fuck's that now? Oh, boy.